Almost forgot about the microphone. Hello there. Hello again. Right. <laughs> you are in those bloody catacombs. Ah, that caused me a lot of grief yesterday. Or earlier in the video. Um, yeah. <laughs> right. We are fighting the balls here. That is the same, like, very same model as the one we fought earlier in previous area. However, it's proving to be a little bit more difficult with kind of tricky moveset. You there attacking me now. <laughs> Alright. Rolling early for a reason. Ow. Oh, here I should have rolled early. Yeah, like I said, this guy is kinda of tricky. Neither was. Oh wow, still hit me. Damn it! I thought it was the other attack. I will have to get a start in here. Oh god, I'm failing that so hard. <laughs> oh god, damn it! Okay, this guy's hard. <laughs> like, I get his attacks wrong all the time. Because there's one that is slow, which is the explosion, which you have to be either far away or roll perfectly. But there's the other one that looks like it's slow, but then it's but then it's super quick and you have to roll early. Yeah, this boss is tricky. It's like designed specifically to, to punish to punish many behaviors, <laughs> like Rolling early or ro rolling too late, you kind of have to read him perfectly. I still mistake the the two jumps that he does. Oh, Jesus, really? So fast. Again. I, I can't tell it, I was trying to roll, I couldn't. Okay, there's a sound cue. Ah, uh, it wasn't fast enough. There's no sound cue, it's it's the fast one, I guess. Ah, okay, wait for the sound cue. Then wrong. <sighs> this guy's hard! Holy shit. <laughs> I guess it's especially hard for the for the melee characters. This is so far by far the most difficult side boss. Or maybe the Crucible Knight from the area jail might prove diff more difficult than this. So let's just label him like the most difficult catacomb boss <laughs> so far. At least for me, personally. Oh yeah, we can use the magic uh, reduction talisman next time. Okay, the back step is too slow to dodge those things. No 
was fine. And it flows. better now. Again, too early. There we go, Jesus. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we just needed to figure out the, that explosion that get, kept getting us killed. Kaiden's cells were ashes. That's what we are getting here. <clears throat> and some red resin. <laughs> Behold, I did it. Well done, skeleton. This one's annoying. <laughs> that is for sure. But we did it. We are done. Okay. Uh, yeah, we are fairly far away from the level. I think I think now we're like at eight thousand required. Yeah, <laughs> it's gonna take some time. Let's look at something. Ah, this thing. I bet it's supposed to take it from facial flesh. Yeah, I never read this description. I think raises vitality. Vitality governs resistance to effects of death. It is said that this. Postul came from the visage of the Prince of Death, he who used to be called Godwin. As first dead of the demigods, it said he's buried deep under the capital at the Earth Tree's roots. Right. Isn't Godwin like the first? First of the uh, demigods. <laughs> yes, first dead, dead of the demigods. Yeah, it said he's buried deep under the capital. Alright. Oh yeah, we <laughs> we have the imp head, owner's headband. I guess we may as well for some protection at least, right? <laughs> I'm tired of that other helmet. All right. Wait, we got in some new stuff for sure. Uh, I kind of wish we had the new like s something. Something to tell me the new items that I've picked up recently, like in other games. It's kind of missing for me. Right now. Raw meat dumpling. Resolve is sweet but causes poison buildup. Yeah, sure. A pungent raw meatball made succulent by virtue of being on the verge of turning. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Warming stone. Rain fragment blessed with an incantation of the two fingers, craftable item, use FP to generate warmth, continuously restoring the HP of the use of those nearby. 
It said that the Earth Tree was once as warm as the gentle sun and would gradually heal all who bathed in its rays. Rot grease. Poison grease. Eesh. Disgusting. Uh, anything else? Best mm. string bloody finger. Attempt an invasion of another player's world, right? If successful, you arrive as an invader, bloody finger, with the objective of defeating the host of fingers of that world. <laughs> uh huh. Kaiden sells for ashes. Ooh. Ashen remains in which spirits yet dwell. Use to summon the spirit of Kaiden sellsword. Spirit of a mercenary belonging to a horse riding folk. Skillfully uses a massive blade made for dismounting other riders and enhances his already considerable strength with war cries. The cell swords of Kaiden made their prowess known on countless battlefields. Page Ashes. Spirit of a page who traveled at the site of the noble he served uses a piercing sword and crossbow to defend his master. One becomes a page merely by accident of being born into obscurity. Nothing is asked of, of ability, talent, or volition. <laughs> Yikes. Peace blood. Fresh beast blood gained him with gold. Gold. Found by hunting carnivorous beasts. This glimmering blood never rots or decays. Ah. Interesting. Slumbering egg. Oh. All eggs that will never hatch. Material used for crafting items. Price as a symbol of the most sublime slumber. Interesting. An nutritious foodstuff that warms from within. The flavor is exquisite. Only those of com comfort. And means not the truth. A crab's eggs are more delectable than its meat. Huh. It's a lot of crafting items. Living jar shard. A fragment of a living jar hardened after its death. Such fragments command a high price due to the magical power locked within. These leaves the living jars unfortunate targets for poachers. Oh. Silver Firefly. A firefly that gives off a silver light, materials in crafting, found near bodies of cold water untouched by sunlight. The light of fireflies is believed to have an alluring magic. Silver light is considered to invite riches. Uh -huh. A firefly whose glowing tail has hardened into glintstone, widely found in Ly Lyurnia Lake, material used for crafting items. Alas, now that its tail is glintstone, it can no longer beguile potential mates. Oh. Crystal cave moss, faintly luminescent moss that grows in dark caves, laced with fine crystals. Among the moss, it possesses unique med medicinal pro properties. Uh, budding cave moss, dragon oil using perfumes. Normal cave moss. Uh huh. A late purple water lily that is on the verge of wilting, material used for crafting items, exceedingly rare to find, but we have 17 of it, <laughs> so I'm not sure about that. A symbol of faith in St. Trina, fills the senses preventing agitation. Agitation. Alright. We have bunches there, glove words and... Yeah, okay. Uh, about here. We've read most of this. Sure. Rare Robin is supposed to get an incantation of the god slaying black flame original within 
Sorcery Scroll of the Carian Royal Family, the heads of the Academy of Royal Caria. Scroll of the Academy of Royal Caria, the Glyn Sorcerer's Family. Rancor Call. Sorcery of the Servants of Death. We didn't find many of those, right? Like, the one single sorcery I found so far in the world? Didn't found any. Someone's vengeful spirits that chase down foes, charging the house's potency. Once for the loss, this ancient dev hex was rediscovered by the Necromancer Garis. So dragon fire. Storm sweep, blood strikes, and sheep, storm color, storm stomp, darkness, storm wall. And yeah, we probably found some new weapons. I mean, I really need to make a <laughs> Clean up here. Is it Cordy? Dagger favored by military positions in white. The pointed blade is hard and sharp, making trickle hits especially potent. Medicine is mercy and mercy upon the part of his ruthless viewer. The killer scoff as men of compassion. Hmm. Uh, huh. Great AP. Large rapier featuring a thin, sharp blade. Commonly used in life or death duels, like a smaller counterpart is made for thrusting attacks and can be used while guarding with a shield. Archean. Uh, Highland Axe. Single sided attacks used by the warriors of the Highlands. Brave combatants begin battle by, cr by crying out their names. Roars are enhanced by this weapon. Great axe of a large arcing blade and long handle, the crescent moon of its name is said to have been spurred by nostalgia. Specializes in sweeping through foes by making use of its long handle. Nothing too interesting, honestly. Brick hammer, <laughs> weapon made from an ordinary stone brick wielded by a laborer who led a rebellion and later became a champion himself. Oh wow! Even among other bludgeons of its size, this weapon is especially weighty. The strength of a giant is required to wield it. Yep. Yeah, the battle hammer is easier to wield. <laughs> yep. A yeah, scythe. A large scythe featuring a long, slender blade designed to reap. This weapon is capable of rapidly inflicting blood loss while also slipping through an enemy's guard. In the hands of a highly dexterous wielder, it is capable of striking fear into the heart of any foe. Cypher pada. Too close. Weapon worn on the fist comprise of sharp parallel blades favored by those who lurk in the dark. Lacerations cause blood loss with great effect. Claw weapons come in pairs and two handling this weapon two handing this weapon will keep it to both hands. Oh, okay. Oh gods so seals are range weapons? Sacred seal of the Godskin Apostles in Lady of Obsidian. Yeah, we read that a moment ago. List of Wooden Great Shield. Great Shield is both high damage negation and guarded capacity, making enemy attacks easy to repel. Yeah, I've seen those. I've seen those. Head covering made from the larger unaltered head of an impish golem. Resembling a cat, it holds trace amounts of felon intelligence. I see. Oh, wait. Oh, we had a. Huh, marionette soldier armor. Yeah, we don't... I don't think we're interested in this one. Armor of metal bands arranged in a lattice worn by marionette soldiers crafted to serve the sorcerers. Oh, so they're like... Automatons kind of thing. The construction of this armor is remarkably crude, now rusted over and severely dented. For a doll, the only thing that matters is that it does not break. Right. Alright. That would be it. From the, from the items. Alright, we were yeah down here. Okay, so let's see if there's anything else down here. We can go back up. And I think I'll go back and I'll try fighting the Crucible Knight again. See how it goes. That is one of the few bosses left in the previous zone. Uh, 
And there are one of those. Stumper Smithing Stone, which is nice. Which is very nice. There does not appear to be much else here. Alright. I guess we came down here for the catacombs mostly. Up, up. Yeah, okay, I think that's that's all we came here for. So wait, if I that's not a problem, I can quickly run on a horse through here back to those locations. I feel like doing some boss fights now, so let's do that. Oh we have to spend our runes first though. Oh, this actually might be a good chance because uh, I actually wanted to buy the parry ashes to apply to the um, to my better shield for parrying. There you are. Yep. Uh, there we go. Ash of War parry. Now, what else did we have here, actually? Uh, we have Stump, Upward Cut, Kick, Endure, Warcry, Spinning Slash, Impaling Thrust, Quick Step, Stormblade. Okay, but nothing else, really. I think this is the only one we needed. Everything else is kind of whatever. Um. What else could we buy? Because we either spend this on something, or we cash out on some rooms for a level, or we farm like the remaining ones. Probably better just to go and buy something. Uh, what do we do? I pretty much bought everything from here. Church of Alec. There is another trader there. Oh yeah, we had a bunch of new things you know, near the trader here, right? Or here rather. Just right next to them. And next to the bonfire, so let's see what, what what they had. I don't I don't remember anymore. Pretty sure there was something I wanted to buy. Ah, not every. Uh, a stock I don't care about. I want to try this hood. That's for sure. Is that it? That might be it, actually. A shield. Hmm, okay. It was the only thing I actually wanted. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Let me use it for now. Okay, so we still have money. Yeah, I guess now we can just spend it on the key. The gargoyle key real, real quick and then we're good. Yep. We have 800 left. But nothing really to buy, I guess. I guess we could 
take a mace just to have like a decent striking weapon since we don't can, cannot really wield anything that we own currently and we want to put like two more levels in dexterity okay all right we're good now we can go face the boss Have some fun with the Crucible Knight. <laughs> Although judging by how my previous uh, previous boss went, I'm not sure. I'm not sure uh, how well it will go, but we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, and we probably want to try at, at least try the um, the weird mini boss in the Stormwave Castle. So that's on the menu too. Great. Let's see if we have any any decent advantage with our new weapon against this guy. Okay, the damage is okay. Ow. Damn, this combat RD is a ton of damage, actually. <laughs> Ow. Fuck up. Okay, yeah. We have a chance now, I think. Damn it. <laughs> You have to be careful about this stun, though. Wait, what the hell? What the hell just happened there? <laughs> Did he just fly? Still caught me in, in the in the explosion, eh? I hate when bosses do that. Like, let me heal. <laughs> that was a big uh, combo. Get warmed up. <laughs> Take a lot of damage. Uh, there is an acquire of Easter's tank. Like, we're not doing a lot of that right now, right? So, what else can we do? Uh, lightning damage, fire damage, not sure which kind of damage he's doing. Guard counter, stamina resisting attacks, has a little horseback, champ attacks, perfective range. Uh, honestly, don't have much <laughs> to, to use otherwise, so I'll be effective against this guy, I think. May as well stay with what we have. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Son Jaime. That has a delay too. Oh, really? Still hit me all the way there. Cool. Oh damn. What the hell is that? What is that attack? Magic? Hard to say. Okay. Remember about that attack? Oh wow, what the hell? Can I elongate that? Okay, okay, so he does that as a follow-up. Alright. Is that magic damage? That looks like magic damage. Let's try assuming it's magic damage, because I think I have something against magic damage. So I'm not really using this, right? Wait, uh, I have fire, lightning, holy... Oh, no, wait, we don't. <laughs> we don't. I assume it's like holy damage or whatever. Here? I right here. <clears throat> we are getting there. Damn it with the slow attacks. Again. <laughs> uh, well, I guess I can only blame myself for rolling from rolling too early. Waiting for too long with that uh, the dot roll there. Alright, we're getting there, we're getting there. 
do be annoying though. We should get there. Excuse me. Was the long combo. No tits. They're really using those. Uh, is this the slow, slow attack? Is this the fast attack? A lot in this game, that's for sure. It's so much more difficult for me, at least, than the the other, the other one, Bloodhound or whatever. God damn it! I just get hit by one one thing and uh, <laughs> just gets you out of it. Yeah, I guess the, the best tactic is just to hit and run, I guess, as usual, as it usually is. And move a lot. Okay. even more into this combo? Holy shit. Basically, if you do this attack too early, he will flow up. Oh no, not the rock! Come on! Uh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Basically, if you attack too early, he will immediately follow up. Reacting to the attack. It's just the Fume Knight treatment, basically. Like, you never know when the combo is over. <laughs> it's 
So let's try to wait for the tail attack, I guess, and then we should be safe to attack after the tail attack. I'm guessing. Early. Combo. Dodge. Hey, okay, wait for the tail attack. Shield is safe, I think. Will be follow up, okay. Alright. The st stamp is usually followed by a bunch of attacks, so that's not that's not a safe window to attack. Alright, we're slowly getting there. Waited too long. He waited with that attack so long, holy shit. very unfortunate attacks from his side <laughs> like basically not giving me any chance to attack and then we 
eventually panicked. We're almost there. I'm sure we are almost there. Yeah, okay, this attack doesn't work with shield because then he follows it up and I land right in, into that attack. After the shield I just have to use normal normal attack. Yeah the, um, the combat art in my weapon is not that good against this guy I guess. Because he has just too many combos. Bugger off, seriously. <laughs> the hell, he's stuck and give this man a stamina. Like, th if, if anything, this is the proof that bosses don't have stamina. Because he, he's basically stuck in that sequence all o over and over again. Yeah, okay. That was not a good run. Let's try again. That's actually what I really liked about Neo, that a lot of the bosses actually had stamina just like you, 
And if they used it up, they, they would get stunned just like you. Kill me. That was really bad. Mm. Reset, refocus, and let's go. Think about it, this guy is probably parable. So if you are if continue to fail this the usual way, we may try parry. Alright, there's like a full combo coming. You do nothing. What about that again? Getting there, <laughs> missing a few hits. It's just really hard to use my combat art for more damage because that deals significantly more damage, right? It's just hard to time it. What's there? We just need, uh, need to to get in a few more hits. The bleeding doesn't work on him. So we don't have that going for us anymore.
That's dangerous, no stamina. Uh, hello? Do be bloody hard. <laughs> Already harder than Godric. Godric was a joke compared to this guy. <laughs> for me, of course. For me. I, I'm guessing it's different for everyone. But uh, for me, it's like... Uh, damn it, this guy. This guy do be annoying. and smooth. There we go. <laughs> Whew. Okay. Aspects of the Crucible Tale. Huh? <laughs> what the hell? What's that? That was only 2,000 runes? What? <laughs> That's not a lot. So what is this? Incantation. Treats supple tail to sweep area before caster. Okay. 
one of the ancient earth tree incantations, creates a sample tail that sweeps through foes before the caster, charging enhances potency. This is a manifestation of the earth tree's primal vital energies, an aspect of the primordial crucible where all life was once blended together. Ah. Okay. Please are faith. Wow. Okay. So we didn't get much from that fight, but we got it. <laughs> At least we got it. Uh, let me check that place with them. With them. Or there's supposed to be a boss at night or something. Real quick. I think it was there. Might be remembering wrongly. Like somewhere around here, I think. Like around where the giants were. Maybe not? Maybe there? Like I thought it was somewhere around here. I actually don't remember. Oh. <laughs> but what we can try is we can try if we can deal with the, the big squeeds. <laughs> the big water thingies. Curious about that too. Should be able to jump here safely. Wait, there's the... Oh, wait, wait. We are in a... Uh, wait. Where are we? This is... The lining in a different place, though. Here? Old Goblin. Where are we? Oh, we are in a completely wrong place. <laughs> I think we should be able to get that other lake. Okay. Maybe not. No, we can't. Uh... Bye bye. I suppose it is called Storm Hills, maybe that's why there is thunder. Not sure. Alright, so let's get on the sea if I can actually deal with that now, like reasonably quickly using the fire resin. for stealth. Hmm, I don't think so. <laughs> took some damage. Oh wait, we need to hit it in the... Ah, we need to hit it in the face. I see. I see what's going on. Oh wow, okay. I see. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> so you probably don't even need fire weapon. We just need to hit it in the face. And that's it. That's all we get. Lanout was ovary. They're not even like real bosses or mini bosses. They're like, you know, whatever. Big monsters. 
So the small ones don't drop that? We need to kill the big one? Are we really losing to the... <laughs> the dragonfly? Uh... What? What? <laughs> what? Yeah, well... Oh, we know now. It's not really worth fighting all that much. Let's kill the other one. It's just from materials, basically. Wait, what? She left a golden seed here. Oh, wow. That's good to know. <laughs> Holy crap. There was such an important item lying, lying, lying here all along. I didn't realize. Oh, that's good to know. But she still doesn't want to talk about... She still doesn't want to talk about the... Um... Chrysalids. Like, I have one, but she doesn't care. Like, I wonder if there's anything... I need to do to trigger that conversation, or what's up? Okay, so you basically have to target its face. That's what they are saying. Of course, it's going to defend it fiercely. Noted. It's literally just for the ovary. Wow. Okay. May or may not be worth it. All that trouble. Alright, let's try here. Try this big guy. This is something we can handle now that we have our new weapon. Wait a second. We still haven't discovered everything here. Oh wow. There must be a way to get there. Okay. <laughs> We have more exploration to do, it seems. Right, there's a door on the other side of this. Of course, like, I don't think we have been like on that other side in general. How do we get there? It's not there, right? How can I get there? Let's see. So we need to get somewhere higher, right? In order to get there. Let's check out the elevator here. Okay, we still have some, some work to do in Castle Stormvale. Like, if there's any place worth, like, exploring completely, it's probably the main story areas, right? Here we are here. We need to somehow get like around there. Look at that. There wasn't any path here. 
circling there, right? Unless it's a hidden path I haven't seen. Wait, hey, 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 there is a way there. I think we should be able to get there somehow. Okay. Just need to figure out how. Yeah, there's no way to get there. For sure. Right now, the hell do we get there, though? Mm -hmm. There's no way here. Yeah, there's like a whole area there. Maybe actually here on the right somewhere, right? Maybe we, we missed... We missed like a ladder or a door or something? be the case but check it out there's something here and I'm assuming there is no way here right like that would be weird yeah all right. Neither on this side, of course. Yeah. All right. So let's check here. Doesn't look like it though, but maybe. That's pretty delayed. Anyways, here. See, anyways, up. Oh. This makes sense. Hmm. I missed some ways here. Maybe there was a way up there. Was that the other thing? He was our friend. There's nothing else here otherwise. How do I get up there? Around that area, right? There's nothing seemingly that will lead me there here. have to face those guys so we may as well kind of backtrack I think there's nothing here that I can see 
least. Um, go away. There's this this wall, right? There's, there's like an entire area to which we can get to somehow. We haven't seen yet. There as well, right? So there must be a way there. Wait a second. Wait a second, Rino. Aha! <laughs> Okay. God damn it, the jumping design changes everything. It literally changes everything. You have to pay attention to the smallest of details. Like if there's a ledge, if there's a ledge somewhere, then you have to consider, hmm, can I jump there? Can I possibly jump there? What is this? I haven't been here either, like down there. Can backtrack from I should have killed the bird. <laughs> so it doesn't get in the way fighting with the knights. Alright, then we know where to go. We know where to go. Let's go here since it's closer. Okay, another mystery solved. There's so much potential for like secrets because of the jumping mechanic. It's actually insane. <laughs> like not that there was no jumping in previous Dark Souls, but there was no like um vertical jumping, right? There was only horizontal. So they, they didn't really pay too much, like they didn't obviously design many things with jumping in mind, but now they can, so... Oh wow, I forgot they could do that. That was fast. God damn it, he's hard. <laughs> I just suck. <laughs> it's that simple. It's like a mini boss too, with that much HP. Wait, I think uh, we can go back to this one for now. Alternatively, we could just grab the item, see if it's worth any effort. Well, flash, of course, it's not worth any effort, but like, he might drop something nice. Force but Oh 
Oh, okay, they enslaved like those spirits? Huh. Alright. Right. Oh, here we are. He's on fruit or oh, fruit. All right. Yeah, we know. Oh, okay, that's <laughs> close. Stone. Yep, this is what we are missing. Spring stones. Bad. Oh no. Right. So we have like a stealth attack, basically. With this weapon. Wow, so many of them. <laughs> Wait, what? How many of them are there here? Okay. That's a lot. It's a lot of bodies. Manor Tower Shield. Oh, hey, Hulk Crest Wooden Shield. I think I missed that one. A tall made inside wooden shield, la la light for its size and easy to handle, adorned with a long forgotten crest of Sorvel ancient design. Manor Tower Shield, an iron great shield large enough to cover the entire body, depicts the round table hold, gathering places of champions. Great shields boast high damage negation and guard capacity, making enemy attacks easy to repel. Surely what you seek is somewhere close by. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, it's this guy. Smithing stone. Jumping required ahead. <laughs> yeah, sure about that. Yep. <laughs> That's precisely where we need to go. Yep. This is like really hidden. Carefully tarnished here. <laughs>
Hmm. Yep. Let's have stay calm. The item. Um. Item? Can I like... <laughs> the item? No? Are people dying because they try to get the item and they can't? Okay. <laughs> I'm guessing so. Stone. Yep, 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 yep. Ha. Noise. May as well rest. Uh, increase them. Uh, no. At charge, yes. Did we do that already? That was sure we... Wait, what? I was sure we picked up a golden seed, huh? Do I need more than one now? Wait, what? Golden Seed, they could sacrifice number of users. We need more than one now. The Golden Seed found at the base of an illusory tree. Increase the sacrifice number of users can be used after resting at the side of grace. When the ring was shattered, these seeds flew from the tree. I need more than one now. How do I know how many do I need? Ah? <laughs> like, I have it here, clearly. Do I need more than one? Interesting. I wish the game would tell me that, somehow. All right. Oh. <laughs> Arterial leaf. That's it. I think. I think it was the last of it. The last of the things we needed to find. This castle, at least I don't remember anything else. I might have missed. So now we have a re reliable way down there to the boss. I don't remember where did I when I was climbing that ladder where did I end ended up but I don't think I can just go there like that so going that was going to be annoying actually that mini boss it's very straightforward and as we can use a bunch of those uh, things that uh, there's like a million of rats on the way Big ratty too. Probably run past them fairly easily. Yeah, it's here. Let's see. It's not too bad in terms of damage, I guess.
very hard to say what he's doing and what should I dodge and what I shouldn't. Okay, of course he has like an AoE. Wasn't too bad actually, despite its size. On seed, okay, nice. Hi, <laughs> well. Glad I came back here. Right, dagger. What was that though? Jesus. And also this, right? Like, what the fuck? Lost in a head. Like, is this another eldritch creature or whatever? Like, what? <laughs> the hell? Liar hand. <laughs> Could this be epical? Like, what is this? This is pretty damn scary. It's basically... I don't know. Yeah, it looks like Eldritch something, right? <laughs> and it's like... Yikes. Hmm. Doesn't look like anything like we've seen in and Jesus, ew, exactly too. Like what the hell? Or is it just literally a giant squid? <laughs> this game can be scary, that's for sure. Remember where this leads. Ah, okay, just here. All right. All right, all right. I think we're done here. Oh, that was a lot of that was a lot of souls. Okay. Uh, <laughs> what next? Wait, I don't remember removing this. Maybe I removed it by accident. Maybe it removes itself, thinking that I don't need it anymore. I don't know. <laughs> uh, yeah, we kind of did everything here. We kind of did. Everything that I know of, anyways. So I think, yeah, we deal with all the bosses we had. We haven't done with... I don't think there's anything else there, so I think we are just good to go back and explore more. Okay, let's try using the seeds again and see if that two are consumed or something. Uh, flasks, add charges, added a charge. Okay. Alright, well, let's see if two of them were consumed. That would be interesting. Yep. <laughs> so you need more than one, but the game doesn't really tell you that. So that's kind of annoying, but uh, sure. Okay. <laughs> I see. Remove that so I don't use it accidentally. Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting. I went to Clement Parry on a War 
on this iron round shield. Some more parry. Yes, please. Oh. That matters, honestly. It's fine. So we can actually use it, right? Hopefully, without going too heavy. Yeah. Okay, we have to dodge those guys because they're a bloody nightmare. And I think we just want to. Oh, okay. Never mind. I like how the game uh, <laughs> politely kicks you out of the map screen when you're under attack. Ooh, there are ruins there. To the ruins, I guess. Dodging those guys if we can. Are those runes or are they just like no, they are purified runes. Maybe just like a new type of runes. What is Dirty Doggo doing in purified runes? Yeah, we have a sneak attack. Here, eh? Not today. And they're tough. There's a lot of them. Ow. Cuckoo Glintstone? <laughs> okay. Cuckoo, you say? Okay, but they are like proper ruins, so we can expect a way, f a way down somewhere here. Oh. Aha! This is item I have. <laughs> Destructible terrain, eh? Chabri grape? Yeah, we found those before. Two fingers heirloom. What's that? Raises faith. Ah, oh, that is the one engraved with the legend of the two fingers, raises so faith. Oh, plus five, five faith. Apparently, it's very heavy. All right, yeah, of course, it makes sense. Uh, it's not great with the legend of the two fingers. Raises faith. Fingers cannot speak, yet these were eloquent. <laughs> Persistently, did they wriggle, spreading out mysteries in the air. Thus did we gain the words, the words of our faith. Ah. Interesting. So we can get... So we have access to five faith. Does it mean we can use the dragon breath or something? Kinda. We still need two arcane, so that's kinda annoying. Right, never mind. It's good to have anyways. So 
So he's good to have. Anything else here? Another ruins like right next to each other. I'm guessing maybe it's like connected. Oh, come out one and all from the darkness underground. Let us offer unto the maiden our eyes. Right, they're all about eyes for the maidens. Okay, so literally all of the enemies were inside that that place. Put it up here. All right. What about that other building then? I mean, there's quite a few of them, so I'm guessing that's like a normal building. It's part of scenery, basically. Or is it? That is. <laughs> Okay. It's a big, uh, <laughs> even bigger crabby there. Okay. But otherwise, I don't think there's much here. Unless there's some uh, parkour that can happen here. <laughs> that will lead us somewhere. Beautiful, oh, beautiful. It's not appear like there is much inside that building. That old building. And I don't think there are any like items on top that we could try to parkour for. Does not look like it. At least not on a pla on on plain sight. All right. Let's see what that crabby. <laughs> How tough that crabby is. I'm mildly curious about that. Hello. Ow! Ow! <laughs> okay. Just spamming our one, eh? Just spamming our one. Uh, although so far, those big mobs have not been exactly worth killing, so... Not sure about this one, too.
Oh, wow. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Too. Jesus, it's gonna spam this? Yeah, it's so fast too. Wow. Okay. <laughs> What are the weak points? What are the weak points? I think soon maybe I'll just try to follow to the next like story main slash main quest location. And maybe I'll do the same tactic like last time that I did a kind of accidentally with Godric or Mar Margit rather <laughs> before Godric even. I'll just get to where I need to go, like my next destination, and then try to do some exploration. Ah, I see. We should do this. We have, a, we have a horsey. Oh. Much easier. <laughs> yep. If they are that much bigger than you. That's it. Stripped of white flesh. <laughs> okay. So it's not like I like I expected. Not worth the hassle. Although now at least we know what is, how to deal with it. Relatively painlessly. Alright, so let's actually do that. Let's actually... So they want us to go like there. So like on this path, I guess, right? You could even go there. Let's stick to this path. I would rather like kind of find my destination first. Like, okay, I'll, I know I need to go there, right? And um, and then we can backtrack and explore some more. Is it another ruins? Oh, no, it's just part of the same location, okay. What happened here? Behold mushroom. <laughs> It's like, what are the sounds? <laughs> yeah, but I think, yeah, this is just part of the, those general ruins, but they don't really have anything inside. Or do they? Wait, what? Ah. Hey, where are you taking me? Where are you taking me? <laughs> Lurnia of the Lakes. What is this? Oh. Okay. So that is like a... Skip? Is this... Wait, is this... The Academy or whatever? Interesting. The random teleporters are really interesting. Ah, 
meeting place map. Wait, what? Where's meeting place? Uh, I don't see any difference. What? Cinema Shaga meeting place. Oh! Oh! Cinema found on a corpse seems to point to a meeting place. The, the man in came from surely desired one. The sole means of gaining entry into the academy, a glintstone key. Ah! Ah! Oh, I see. So presumably, it's around here. Presumably. So we do want to explore this location too. Seven seal, you cannot proceed with a glinson key, okay. This does not look good. Oh wait, now we are behind. That's a lot of bad stuff happening there. <laughs> Yeah, okay. <laughs> this is the same as before. We have the very warm welcome. I guess, I guess we can technically sneak past all that. Or we could try and fight it. <laughs> because why not? I really wish I could use that. Yeah, it's the same guys as before, they are not too bad. Yeah. So it's really no big deal, I guess, fighting them here. Secret path? Okay, now. Ooh, blue white wooden shields. Alright. All this is there. Okay. So these are... No, but that on the top is. Oh, we haven't been there yet. Okay. <laughs> this place is. Huge. I can already tell that this map does not end there. There's <laughs> probably more to it. I guess, I guess this is just a way to avoid all of that. I'm curious about. This is an enemy. Holy shit. <laughs> this game is just full of surprises. Or I had one. I guess it's gonna be easier to navigate this if you actually open the map from the other side, so... There's a... Beetle somewhere here. Hear it faintly, but it's hard to tell where it is. Uh huh. So much going on here. <laughs> I can 
go there. There's a bunch of those guys. Like, uh, what? Oh, that lady. What are you going to tell me? Oh, wow. If it wasn't for the teleporter, like, how else? Like, we find it randomly, but how else would we get here? <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, there is no bridge here. I see. We can just teleport back here. And uh, just go there instead to unlock this. It's going to be easier to move around with it. I guess. Yeah. It's kind of far away. Yeah, maybe we can do some slide exploration Why we try to get there. Maybe we can probably just get down here. <laughs> okay. Exploring rooftops. Academy Gate Town. Okay. Exploring rooftops on a horse is kind of interesting. Ooh, the seed. The seed, oh. Oh, what's that? Academy Gate Town, okay. What is that, gang squad? It's a swamp area, but thankfully it's not a poisonous swamp area. <laughs> There's that going for us. Uh, ah, still there. Ah, there we go. Oh, look, everything in one place. Map and grace. <laughs> okay, uh, let's verify our assumptions then. Yeah, I think it's there. Yeah, it's here. Okay, so here is where is the key. He's there, so I guess let's go there, grab the key. And then we can explore like this whole area. And this area here. Oh the entrance okay, ah never mind. So here yeah, okay, okay, I gotcha. So here's the the academy thingy. Here's this little like a castle that we sneak by. Here's the, the the whole academy town. 
that someone built on what that somehow built on water oh, there's a telescope there all right there's supposed to be more ruins here <sighs> scale of this game okay how do we get there though that's the question right can we just basically ride there like i'm guessing like from here so we could try and so there, probably going through the middle is gonna be easier. Not sure. Let's try. Let's ignore everything. Run there and see if we can get there. Unless there's something that, <laughs> that captures our attention. Like this thing. Ah, of course. This is weak, weak spot. You know that already. Only that, smithing stone? Oh. Item, but prone. <laughs> yeah. There's a lot of them here. Oh, and there are the balloons here too. but soldiers in a bundle yeah and it's a very bad idea to fight them on a horse We went in a completely wrong direction. Apparently, we need to go, need to go there. I realize now that I look pretty much like those Aiden Raiders. My sword is just slightly more fancy. Ooh, like an upgraded version of that plant. Or recolored, rather. of them here, eh? I think I'm still going in the right direction. Oh wow, okay. We're under other heavy fire apparently. Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh no. Answer me, would you? Uh oh. Hello, friend. Tell me if you know, would you? The whereabouts of the hidden house of those despicable fiends. The recusants who hunt their fellow tarnished. They laid hands upon my servant Lanya, and I refuse to let the insult stand. The tale of House Hoslo is told in blood. I, Dialos, swear to deliver the message. Okay. They laid hands upon my servant. The tale of I. Oh. So. That being said, we are, we are on a mission here. Yeah, I thought I could hear you. Hello? Where are you? The 
lot of you, so I think I'm, <laughs> I'll pass. Plenty of you. I can. It's a huge swamp. Like, I mean. <laughs> this game is absolutely massive. Ah. Uh, so many enemies to yeah, that's the economy. That is also adequately massive. Riding on a horse. Very long distance. Yeah, almost there. <laughs> almost there, actually. I didn't found any grace in, in the, on the way. So that might be annoying if we die to something on the way. Are those something stone? All right, there we go. So the glintstone should be in there. Should be somewhere here. Unless I got the location wrong, but I'm pretty sure this is here. Pretty sure. There, there's, there will be like a boss or mini boss guarding it. Oh, great. Great. Fantastic. Let's see. Wait, is this close to? <laughs> Examine. Seek three wise beasts. What? <laughs> Seek three wise beasts. Uh, what? Oh, you're very much aggressive. I mean. Hey, of oh, you are here. Yes. Looks to be endless. Three wise beasts. Huh. This is rise. You must solve the puzzle to enter. Huh. So I guess we have to explore anyways. Yeah, I'm guessing they're yeah, they are great. They are endless. And we need to find three wise beasts. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. So it wasn't that simple. Apparently. Oh, we are bathed in blood. Jeez. I'm 
guessing they're like those monsters. Yeah, they are all over this island. Ah. All right. All right. Well, we need to find three wise beasts somewhere. Does it point me in there? Wait, apparently, I'm constantly in combat. Okay, so does it point me to the beasts, or does it just point me to the, I don't know to the next next thing after this already? Testus rise. Three wise beasts. Huh. Well, we have a lot of uh, <laughs> a lot of searching to do. That's for sure. That's there, right? That place. Like, it must be there. Yeah, there are like two islands next to each other. Right? Oh, no way! What am I saying? It's here! Okay, so this is different. It's here. Okay, never mind. I'm in the wrong place. <laughs> You remember? Oh, okay. There's a thing there. We'll remember. Yeah, it's actually there. So you went way too far. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. It happens, it happens. We got it wrong. Ooh, so Free real estate? Not exactly, but. We still managed to grab like nothing. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. You're angry, you're angry. I get you, I get you. I go away. <laughs> so much. Wait, what? Who are you? Spectral Raider? Ah. Okay, a bit more. Ooh, grace. Ain't this game beautiful? Holy crap! Okay, so this should be here. Should be this islet. Yeah. The meeting place. Those flying things. <laughs> of course, there's a dragon. Of course, there's a dragon involved. There's the key. Okay. He obtains. Let's see if we can kill the Dragonair. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this one will be this one will be tough. 
So I could try fighting fighting it on foot. But fighting on foot, there's a problem because he'll just fly fly away, right? And it's going to be very hard to get to him again. I think it might be overall easier to fight him on a horse. Rooms. Oh, oh no. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's go away because Beams of Dragon Smarag. Because we have some runes, spare runes that for we have a decent amount of runes that I don't want to keep picking up, so. Okay. I'm not fighting him anymore. Chill out, music. <laughs> Chill out. All right. All right. Well, we have the key, so we can technically already start exploring. If we do that and see if something happens. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, okay, I see. Hmm. Lyurnia of the Lakes. All right. Well, that wasn't too bad. I mean, we can go there if we want to. It's definitely not too bad. We can already go towards the next boss if you want to. Oh nice, we can actually use horse here. Oh nice! Yes, yeah, it pays off to go <laughs> to go for the main path. It definitely does. Okay, here is death, I'm pretty sure. So gotta skip that for now. Yeah, this place is huge. Ah, so this is not even the, the place, this is just like the entrance to the place. Like this thing here, it's like a gate, basically. Uh. Wait, what? Say what? Bellum High. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh! Oh, right, because we were teleported from here all the way there. Okay. <laughs> wow. All right. All right. Damn. So do we get to upgrade our flask again? Yeah. Alright. Well, that's good. We have eight now. It's going be a lot, actually. <laughs> and she's here, but yeah. We don't want to talk to her. Ah. Huh. Okay. But that's convenient. That's convenient, that's for sure. So 
So I can just go back here and explore like this area here, right? <laughs> Damn. Oh, there's a lot of Wolfie here. <laughs> oh, the merchant. Got that. Okay, it's not a good idea to fight next to the merchant. In beast bones. It's kind of thick. It's kind of thick, though. Well, there's been an age since I've seen a customer. How can I help here at the okay. end of the earth? The end of the earth, you say? Earth? Wait, earth? I'm pretty sure we are not on earth. <laughs> uh, fang imp ashes. Someone two fang imp spirits. Okay. Here's Lily. Eye of Yellow. What are used for crafting items? Grown in lands afflicted by frenzy. The a sharp fruit bursting with ribbon pulp. Material used for crafting items. Grown in lands afflicted by frenzy is used for its pain relieving properties, though it's also known to be a dangerous intoxicant. Oh, he has cheaper keys! Only for 3k, not 4k. Lost Ashes of War. Empty Ashes of War devoid of any memories of battle. Unable to apply any kind of affinity in their current state, but can be used by smithing Master Hugh of their own table hold to recreate other ashes. Thus does the copy pass into becoming the genuine article. Favor is cookbook. So we get soporific grease. Draws another another grease. Drawstring soporific grease. Sleep born arrow. Okay. Oh, it's a sleeping one. Don't care about that. St. Trina's Arrow. Meteor Bolt. Wow. Blue Cloth Cow. Cow of a nomadic warrior, and the blue color of its fabric symbolizes brisk waters as fluid and flowing as the sword in the hand of his wearer. Blue Cloth Vest. Vest of a nomadic warrior. Okay. Okay. I'm uh, not sure if I'm gonna like it, but it's not that expensive, so maybe we'll buy it just to see how it looks. Give it a sacrificial tweak. Oh, excuse me. Revenants. An old soul by the Mother Merchant contains information about Revenants. And an old by the Mother Merchant contains information about the Frenzied Flame Village. Let's get the notes. You know what? Um, safe journey. Anything else? Let's get this. Let's get this. Let's get this. How does it look? Safe journey. Oh, we have sage rope. Very nice. Okay, it's slightly worse for physical, but better for magical. But a lot weighs a lot less. It's not the worst. I don't think I like it much, though. Okay, let's stick to what we have. <laughs> 
So if that's the case, does is there anything else I want? We just buy this, right? <laughs> Oh, uh, excuse me. Do I, wanna, I, do I wanna save up for the level? Yeah, maybe save up for the level. We know we can buy. Basically, we know we can buy a bunch of keys from different merchants right now. Right, and now we are back to the to this place. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Another of those, like a, like a normal mob. Shit. Ah. We can do that too. Celestial do. Carry out absolution at the Church of Vows. A hidden tier found in the Eternal City, also known as Night Tier. Allows one to carry out an absolution at the Church of Vows, reversing all antagonizations. <laughs> okay. Once upon a time, the stars of the night sky guided fate, and this is a recreation of those times. Alright. Okay, I wish they would mark merchants on the map. Oh, okay, so we can? Put our own, apparently. Alright. They really want us to do that, I guess. Uh, by ourselves. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, it's kind of useful. So we can we can basically put our own markers, right? So they don't bother us with like thousands of markers on the map. We just put the ones that we want to put. Alright. <laughs> That makes sense. And right, and there's one more uh, here. Right. Okay. Hey, what do we do next? Uh, so we have the option between actually exploring this place, right, and, and moving on with the main plot and the main tasks at hand. Or exploring. So probably in order to get there, we need to find like another teleport or something. So probably that's how we can get there. I'm also curious to just go there and see if the map extends more <laughs> to the south. Probably does. Probably it's gonna be a like much bigger map overall. But before I do any of that, be right back.
Sorry for the wait and for the possible noise. I dropped the controller on the, on the way out. Uh, yeah. Alright, uh, let me... Let me go here. I'm actually curious what's there. And uh, if the map will... There's actually quite a bit of space there, though. <laughs> so it's very likely that the map will actually extend way below that. But nevertheless, I want to I wanna see for myself. Real quick. Uh, if I remember correctly, there was like a guarded bridge on that other to lead me on that other side, so might not be that easy to get there. Uh, we should see. All oh, right, and we can also actually. I think there's a way to get there outside of the bridge. So let's try that too. Not that I remember. I think there was. Was there? I think it was there, actually. Double jump on a horsey is so fun. <laughs> I don't know, wait, I must be dreaming then. I thought for sure there was a way. Ah, here. I think here? Nah. It's too far away. Or is it? <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> ah, no, no, no. Okay, don't, don't die, don't die, don't die. Alright, <laughs> we got there. So, but we don't know where the map here is, right? They are not telling me. Just gonna do what I, what I wanted to do, ignoring everything else. Alright, let's get back on this main path here. At least there's a grace. Still confused by the <laughs> by the controls every now and again. So does this place does the map extend beyond here? Probably does. Mighty shot. Okay. Ah, there we go. There's the map. And uh, another merchant. Nice. Okay. It's a lot of them. They conveniently all look the same. <laughs> This one is straight to the point. So I guess there goes the idea of leveling. <laughs> Scale armor. Armor reinforced with small metal scales. This The cape covering the shoulders is made with threaded rock lizard skin and provides ample protection against fire. Okay. So it's yeah, particularly good against fire. Oh, Crimson Armor Medallion. Demi human mobs. <laughs> Crack pot. 
Oh, 2000. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Light crossbow. Why we haven't seen a bow yet? Like, of all things. Of all things, we haven't seen a bow yet. Don't like crossbows. Uh, wondrous physic. Classic wondrous physic still remains in the church of Marika, north of Mistwood. Okay, we still don't know where it's Mistwood. Huh, say the demi humans mob leader first, and the rest will lose panic. Land squares are soft where they touch the ground, and poison will cause them to rupture. Okay. <laughs> the heads of the stone the controls bear old wounds. Revenants. The crawling royal revenants and their followers are or cursed. Healing powers will harm rather than mend. Okay. Friends in Flame Village. South of the Grand Lift of Dictus lies the Frenzied Flame, a village inhabited by the sick. Stay well away. Ah. We have to reference those later, I guess, numerous times to figure out all the secrets. Okay, judging by the... Yeah, <laughs> it very much does <laughs> extend, so doesn't it? Weeping Peninsula. Wait, what? Already shooting at me? And putting me in combat, apparently. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm guessing there's like a giant there shooting at me or something. Wait, is it like a mini small castle? Still shooting. Or like. A wall? Still in combat, apparently. Can we uncombat? Ah, oh, there we go. <laughs> okay. Oh, but I think okay, we found the uh, we found the edge. I think this might be the edge. Yeah, this looks like the edge. All right, so there's not much, that much there, just this one place. But I'm guessing this is, judging by this, this is like another, another um, shard barrel location. I I imagine. Oh, oh, so those are the air trees, maybe, or that. You know, the, the major air trees or whatever. So we can actually see what, what that's all about. Or does, like, mark, weird marks. This might be another jail. No, jails are like that. It could be. Alright, so... I wonder if the world is like this, like elongated like that. <laughs> that would be interesting. I mean, I hope not. I hope it kind of extends. No, oh, yeah, it does. It definitely does extend there. Probably extends to the left too. Yeah. <laughs> it's a massive world. This do be a massive poison swamp. Ah. <laughs> oh, there's a clock. I just noticed it on the right. It's the first time I realize it's there. <laughs> okay, so we're late in the day, you say. So many things we can explore randomly. It's mind boggling. Ow. 
Okay, they really don't like us here. Apparently. Okay, so I guess this is like a wall, basically. Protecting that place. Alright. I'm actually curious about this tree now. I have to finish soon. Let me go have a quick look, actually. Yellow Ember. Okay. There's supposedly something there, too. There was that. But first, I'm really curious about the tree. I think. So let me try and get to it. Okay, we need to go around here. Oh wait, is it, is it Ailing Village? Okay, so this might be the crazy fire village <laughs> that we just found randomly. A of yellow. Oh, okay. It's the thingy we could buy in the previous shop. Okay. Maybe that's the way to explore. Like, just run around randomly <laughs> until you find some things. I get there though. Just further around. Oh, Grace. Just run around randomly, find stuff, and then go back to, the stu to that stuff and explore. <laughs> Might be it. Oh. I get there. Oh, okay, yeah, just go back to this, right? Because we are on a hill here. Just need to go back down. Yep, okay, yeah, it's right next to the, the bridge we were looking for. Oh. All right. Yikes. <laughs> Lots of flowers. It's going to collapse on me. Good. Are weak. Just think. They're like three protectors. Hmm. Yeah, they also deal like kind of damage. I guess I was meant to explore here earlier. It's very possible. <laughs> Alright, let's go for that tree. Like, I'm really curious what it is all about. Like it. 
Try a horseback battle. I guess let's try. Air tree avatar, huh? All right, it's very oh well. I'm guessing we were meant to be here earlier. I think we might be better off on 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 legs. Yeah, let's give it like a one shot, one more, a few tries. We have to finish soon. Doesn't look particularly strong though, like very low HP. So feels like I was meant to come here earlier. <laughs> That's gonna be that's gonna be we have the time. Yeah, but we do like massive damage to it. This attack's a problem. <laughs> this attack's very much a problem. But I think this is holy damage, so... Let's equip our holy damage thingy. We should be good. Yeah, judging by its health, like, we definitely should have... Like, could have come here earlier. Like, this is meant to be, like, the early zone, I think. Oh yeah. Oops. But it does this massive damage to me, so maybe it's just squishy. That was the wrong button. That's what I was planning to do. Okay, here it comes. That wasn't too bad. This and this. That's what we're trying to do. There you go. I was like, what's going on? <laughs> There's just another guy here. Opalane Bubble Tear. Crimson Burst Crystal Tear. Alright. That, was, that was, wasn't too bad. this uh, what did we get yeah we really need like a this item is new thingy <laughs> it's so hard to tell uh oh, okay crimson burst crystal tear item effects steadily versus hp for a time in mixed physic wait what a crystal tear forms slowly over the ages where the earth tree's bounty 
falls to the ground, can be mixed in the flask of wondrous physic. Okay. The resulting concoction gradually restores one HP over time. And opaline bubble tear, a crystal tear forms slowly over the ages where the earth tree's bounty falls to the ground. Can be mixed in the flask of wondrous physic, provides significant damage and negation. However, this effect only occurs once and will expire after a certain duration. Where can I get that? Flask of Wondrous Physic. It was like north of somewhere, right? My, uh, this is minor air tree. Okay, never mind. <laughs> huh. Interesting. Oh, there's another jail there. Alright, so I guess... I think maybe we'll just explore this area just out of curiosity. Like later. Like since it kind of seems like we were meant to explore here. Early, judging by the strength of the enemies. Or like how weak they are, essentially. So I'm kind of curious. I'm kind of curious. Uh... Alright, I'll just finish here. It's kind of out in the open, but whatever. See you later!